Today I'm going to be talking about 9.9 .9 horsepower, 15 horsepower, 18 horsepower Tahatsu and 15 horsepower Supermerc um, and the difference is inside the power head. We've got a few apart on the bench here um, so let's get into it. Cool. So here we got the uh, 15 horsepower Supermerc which is the same capacity as an 18 horsepower Tahatsu with a few differences which I'll get into. Okay, so we have here two blocks. This is a 9.9 .9 15 horsepower Tahatsu. This is an 18 horsepower Tahatsu and the same block as the 15 horsepower Super Merc. Okay, so inside you notice the bores in this one are a lot smaller. They're about five mil smaller in uh, diameter. And also the ports, these are the inlet ports. You can see, okay, that you can see that the inside porting on the casting of aluminium doesn't match the cast iron bore on the 9.915. So it's quite a small port, there's three of them. This side's the same. So see the actual aluminium casting is smaller than the cast iron ball, whereas the 18 horsepower, very, very big inlet ports. And this side here, so the, the actual aluminium casting matches the uh, cast iron balls. Pretty big bores and pretty big um, ports in comparison to the 9.915, which are a lot smaller. I'll just flip these over so you can actually get a view on the um, physical difference here. Okay, so there you go. Very easy to see. Very, very easy to see. And here, this uh, crank is out of the 9.915 Tahatsu. This is the largest cylinder from the uh, 15 Supermerc or 18 horsepower Tahatsu. So it's, it's about five millimeters bigger in diameter. Every other sort of measurement on it seems the same, same height. Um, they use the same crankshaft assembly as 9.9, 18, they're all the same. Um, here's the heads. So 9.9, 15 horsepower Tahatsu, 18 horsepower Tahatsu, and 15 horsepower Super Merc, which is the Japan built 15 horsepower Mercury. Um, there's not much difference in the design of these heads apart from obviously this head is designed for the bigger capacity which is okay so we've got the Tahatsu specifications here there's an old old uh, manual but and where are we super Merc oh, here we go 18 18 horsepower 294 cc if that comes out 15, 9.9, 247 cc. Okay, here you go, cylinder, bore and stroke. So the diameter of the 18 piston is 60 millimeters. 15, 9.9 .9 is 55. And the stroke on both is 52 millimeters, up and down. Here we got the Mercury book. Just to show you that it's the same. 15 super. Come on, focus. Two ninety four CC. Gear ratios and everything are the same throughout the whole lot on them. Um, so other than that, the fifteen horsepower Supermerc is restricted um, in the. Where is it? Here. Okay, so here we got a stator out of an 18 horsepower. And so when I've had them apart in the past, 
this this cam here this cam here that opens up the carburetor at full throttle the 15 horsepower Super Merc has a different cam than the 18 horsepower Tatsu so the carb carburetor doesn't actually open all the way on a 15 horsepower Super Merc as opposed to the 18 horsepower Tatsu um, I have changed them over in the past on the 15 horsepower Super Mercs to get the 18 horsepower and that works totally fine um, not a massive noticeable difference in it at all but if it's there I always say why not while we're on it Mercury 8 horsepower you are not the US model that's the Japan model same as the 6 horsepower and they are the same as the Tahatsu as well built by Tahatsu so the 6, 8, 9.8 they are all the same capacity I know having the 9.8s apart before um, they've got different exhaust plates um, different carburetor and uh, what else uh, different head much much more compression in the 9.8 I've, had, I've seen 140 psi in the 9.8 horsepowers I've seen only about 100 in the the 6 and the 8s um, so yeah but the 9.8 is a very good motor um, that 8 I've got a high compression head on so it's more like a 9 I guess um, yeah anyway whilst I had all this apart I thought I'd do a quick video of insides cheers thanks